all of you that are here, all the fans, turn around and look at all those hands that are stuck up in the air. You're standing amongst heroes. Here are law enforcement officers. Thank you for putting your lives on the line in order to save those around you. Each day that you wake up, put on your badge, you know there's a chance that you might not get back home to take it off. You enforce rules. You ensure safety. And get labeled with a bad guy reputation just because you want to make the world a safer place. You run towards things that most people run away from. And you deserve to know that your hard work and bravery does not go unnoticed. To our firemen, thank you for doing so much more than just putting out fires. When you go to work each day, you could be signing up to save a cat from a tree, delivering a baby on the side of a road, or to save a child from a wrecked car. Other days, you could be rescuing a family from a burning house, or responding to an event that most of us will never see. Either way, you put yourself in harm's way every day so that you can keep others around you safe. And you also have our eternal thanks. To our paramedics and medical personnel, you are often the difference between life and death. You are the calm voice among the chaos that says everything is going to be okay. You have made a difference in so many lives. Your bravery, skill, and passion is seen in all the lives that you have saved. To you, each and every person that goes to work with the goal of making a difference and saving a life, you are all amazing human beings. And tonight, we honor you. All your efforts and the things that you do day in and day out to make the world a better place. So from all of us here at Boyd Speedway, all the fans, we want to thank you. And now, before we do our prayer, if everyone would join me in a round of applause for our firemen, our police officers, and our paramedics. Let us pray. Dear Heavenly Father, we want to thank you today for having the people in our lives, the ones we know and the ones that we don't, the people who we look up to, we respect, and we honor. We want to thank you for giving them the gifts that you have given them and the way that they use these gifts to help and save others. Lord, we want to thank you for the wonderful earth that we live in today. All of our blessings. Again, the ones that we see and the ones that we can't. We ask you to watch over us tonight. All of us here, fans, drivers, crew, track personnel, and our service responders. And Lord, also watch over our service men and women, wherever they may be standing in harm's way so that we can do what we love to do here at home. Lord, watch over us as we make our way home from here tonight. Protect us and keep us safe. All these things we ask in your son's name we pray. And everyone said, Amen. Thank you, Mitch. Joining our color guard tonight, Dylan Cole in the 426 Sportsman car carrying the flag. Driving the police car, Assistant Police Chief Clint Uselton, and carrying the flag, Brian Williams, Mayor of East Ridge, Georgia. Standing carrying our flag will be firefighter. And at this time, we would like everyone to please join us with our hands over our heart, facing the flag for the pledge with our Pledge of Allegiance with Silas Carter.
indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, Silas. Please remain standing with your hands over your heart and join in the singing of our national anthem with Zachary, the Boston Zachary. Go with American All-Star Late Model Series qualifying and I'll turn the 